Hey, bye, it's Tuesday. Happy Tuesday to you. We're going to read again from Mark's, this time, chapter 7. When the Pharisees, some scribes who had come from Jerusalem, gathered around Jesus, they observed that some of his disciples ate their meals with unclean, that is, unwashed hands. And they do not eat without carefully, for the Pharisees, in fact, all the Jews do not eat without carefully washing their hands, keeping the tradition of the elders and coming from the marketplace. They do not eat without purifying themselves and many of the things they have traditionally observed. This purification of cups and jugs and kettles and beds. Mm -hmm. And so he and went on to say, why the prophesy, you, Isaiah prophesied about them and said, these people honor me with their lips, but their hearts are far from me. In vain do they worship me, teaching as doctrines human precepts. But their hearts are far from me. Hmm? That means they keep the externals, but internally God's grace is not touching them. There was an article in Wall Street Journal to point to some new research that said that proves that many, what many workers already know. Employees fake a positive outlook when the boss is around. Oh, really? No shock there, is it? And all that fakery can be exhausting. The research reported first in the Journal of Occupational and Organizational Psychology concluded that workers tend to put on smiles and fake happiness when higher-ups were in the room. By contrast, when workers hold meetings with their peers or those on lower status, they tend to express themselves more honestly. I think we kind of know that instinctively. Yeah, if I'm in a room with the bishop, you think I'm going to put on a good appearance? <laughs> you know, everything's great, bishop, you know, whatever, that's how it is. In a way, it's like with these people with God, they're externally expressing, you know, smiling and looking happy, contented, but inside, that's not the situation. And so what God asks of us, that we worship him, it's not simply going through the motions, not simply doing externals, but it must come from within our hearts. And if one does not sense that or even have that feeling, then you pray, Lord, I want to worship you sincerely and honestly. I don't want to simply go through the motions. But what I express on the outside I want to be found on the inside of me as well. God bless you.